Baker, based out of Banff, Alberta, Canada. And I appreciate you taking the time to be here today. In case you haven't noticed, this is sound only, so there's no visual. And I encourage you to close your eyes and be in a relaxed, comfortable, quiet, distraction-free space. And if you're totally new to Universal Sphere, uh, I encourage you to go on the Universal Sphere public Facebook page. There's all kinds of information and videos, etc. And uh, I do appreciate you uh, taking the time out of your day to watch this. So we're going to get right started. So close your eyes. We're going to take a few nice deep breaths to get centered, grounded, and relaxed. So as you're breathing in, you're breathing in possibility. And you're being open and curious. And as you're breathing out, you're letting go of any stress, worry, or concern that you have. So you're breathing in possibility. And you're breathing out anything you'd like to let go of. So on your own pace, keep doing some nice deep breaths. And as a gentle reminder, be breathing from deep in your belly. So you're getting a full inhalation and full exhalation. So you're fully inhaling and fully exhaling. And with you being here watching this, whether it's live or at a later time, you are an open and curious person. And what I'd like you to do is to take a note of how you're feeling. So are you feeling relaxed? Are you feeling nervous? Are you feeling anxious? Are you feeling grateful? Are you feeling excited? So take a note of how you're feeling right now. And just let you know, you'll not be learning how to do Universal Sphere today. That being said, you, anyone watching live or at a later time will benefit from the energies that are created today. And what I'd like you to do now is to take note of something you would like energetic support around. It could be one of many things. It could be something in October that you desire to complete, like a target or goal. It could be something in October that you would like to let go of. It could be something in your life that's going well and you'd like to go even better. For example, a relationship, a job, a business. You could also ask for energetic support around your primary 2019 intention. We still have almost three months left in 2019, so we still have lots of time for that intention to come to fruition. So think of something you'd like energetic support around. And make sure it's short and easy to remember. And if you have to write it down or put a note in your phone, that's quite all right. And at this point, what I'd like you to do is just ensure that you're in a distraction-free space. So if you do have um, notifications, um, you know, you can quickly open your eyes to turn those off. Um, do your best to be in a relaxed, comfortable position, whether it's in a comfortable chair like I am. You could be lying on a couch, lying in bed, wherever it is. And uh, so I'll give you a little bit of time just to make sure you get settled and turn off any notifications. And for those of you tuning in live, I really appreciate it. It's always nice to know that there's people here with me at the same time. And uh, I truly feel that we are all connected. And um, the Universal Sphere is an energy tool that is very new. And every time a Universal Sphere is done, it raises the vibration of the person receiving it, 
as well as the person creating it. So for myself, I will be benefiting from this as well. And uh, in case you had to do different things there, um, I'll ask you to close your eyes again. And we're going to begin. So, so really settle into the space. Let go of the thoughts of your intention and how you're feeling. So do your best to move from your head space to your heart space. The universal sphere is a feeling process, not a thinking process. And all of us in this 3D world um, can sometimes be in our heads too much, myself included. So, so continue to do some nice deep breaths. And I'm just starting to create the sphere. And as I'm doing so, I really encourage you to picture a set of double doors in front of your heart chakra or in front of your heart space, in front of your chest. So picture, pretend like you have this massive set of double doors in that area of your body. And what I'd like you to feel is those doors opening up. And as they're opening, you're receiving and truly feeling the non-conditional support and the non-conditional love coming to you. The collective consciousness has 24-7 non-conditional love and non-conditional support for all of us. And at this point in time, you are consciously receiving that. <clears throat> so at this point in time, really, <clears throat> really feel this love and support that's coming your way. And it's, it's filling your body with an incredible amount of warmth gratitude and joy and really enjoy feeling this coming in and throughout this whole process if you're feeling something great if you're not feeling anything great I encourage you to release any expectations you have about this experience today. Bottom line is you are receiving this energy, whether you feel anything physically or not. So, I've, so as you have your set of double doors in front of your chest, your heart chakra fully open, I'd really like you to be grateful. Be grateful that you're receiving this love and support that we're all bathed in 24-7. And be grateful that you chose to be here right now, whether it's live or at a later time. There's many things you could be doing right now. And you made the choice to be here right now. And I appreciate that. So you're really feeling grateful for receiving this non-conditional love and non-conditional support from the collective consciousness. And as I'm creating this sphere, I am feeling the energy building. I'm just going to be silent for a few breaths here. And then again, I just encourage you to be in a place of gratitude for receiving. At this point in time, what I'd love for you to do is focus on the feeling of sending back that non-conditional love and non-conditional support to the collective consciousness. So envision you sending that 
through those double doors back. Mm -hmm. So it's a reciprocal exchange. And as you're sending that, just really focus on the feeling. And again, if, you're, if your mind is drifting off to things coming up in your day, to things from yesterday, just be gentle with yourself. Remind yourself to come back to this space and to really focus on those double doors in front of your chest, in front of your heart chakra. And if a visual helps you, you can you can envision a just a flow. So the flow is coming in and out. Picture a uh, being like being on the beach, and you see the water and the waves coming in and out. And that's what's happening right now with these double doors. <clears throat> is you're both receiving and sending. So it's this flow of non-conditional love and non-conditional support. And at this point in time, I'm slowly going to release the sphere. And as I'm releasing the sphere, just focus on your breathing. Stay in your heart space. Just continue taking nice deep breaths. And at this point, I'd like you to bring to mind your intention that you set at the start of this call. So bring that to mind. And focus on the feeling of being grateful that it happened. And just to repeat, bring to mind your intention that you thought of at the start of this experience and focus on the feeling of being grateful that it has happened. And really, really feel that and sit in this space. So again, stay still. Continue to take nice deep breaths on your own pace. And if you're someone who visualizes, you can visualize that and being grateful that it has happened, whatever it is. So focus on that feeling and really feel it as best as you can in every cell of your body. Feel grateful and feel grateful that it's happened. And at this point, I'd ask you to bring yourself back to the physical space so you can start doing some light stretches you can roll your neck, wiggle your toes and fingers. And for any of you who are comfortable sharing, I'd greatly appreciate any feedback. So please feel free to comment below. If you're not comfortable sharing publicly, that's quite all right. I trust you had a great experience today. And for any of you who are interested in learning Universal Sphere, there are many events listed on the Universal Sphere public Facebook page. And I do thank you for coming today. Enjoy the rest of your day and take care.